just around the river bend. I look once more. Okay, can you close your eyes? Done. He's so cute. I love him. On the free up cycle. One, <laughs> three, up cycle. Up cycle. Kelsey. My name is Becky. And I'm Gabby. I waved too soon. I'm sorry. Try again to keep this intro because it's super funny if you keep it like this, but also do it again. Hi, everyone. My name is Kelsey. My name is Becky. And we're the Sorry Girls. And today, we're here with Gabby. Okay, that, now you got I'm it. You got it. <laughs> cool. So we are here at Gabby's brand new home, helping her make over her office, which will be a video on your channel, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very hype. But while we were also here, she was like, can you guys help me with some other things we have going on? And we're like, yes, we will help you. You had a couple pieces around your house that you like love the idea of, but they're not working for the spaces, right? Yes. And a lot of pieces that I actually didn't even mean to bring here with me, <laughs> oh. and they got here with the movers. So I'm like, well, I'm stuck with them now. <laughs> Might as well. So one of our favorite things to do is upcycling and making old furniture cool again. So we have a couple pieces that we're gonna help you make awesome. Yes. Okay, so the first thing that we're doing is this old writing desk that I actually found on the side of the street like when I first moved to LA. And I thought it was so cool because I love antiques. Yeah. And I saw it and I was like, I can make this cool. Destroyed it, <laughs> kept it for five years anyways, tried to throw it away when I moved, and now it's here. But I had a cool vision for it where I thought, let's make it into a coffee nook yes. in my bedroom. So shall we? I feel like I'm birthing a secretary desk right now. What? Well, look at this I stand just I have. Oh my god. The birthing process? This is going in your bedroom, right? This is going in my bedroom. Like, what would you say the theme is in like three words? The theme I would say is traditional, eclectic, mm -hmm. and rich. Okay. Ooh. Oh, upstairs. I meant like rich in color, not rich like I make a lot of money. <laughs> I just wanted to clarify. Like this, this hat is from a thrift store. I'm still relatable. <laughs> okay, so I found these at Goodwill yesterday, and they were just perfect. I knew I wanted this to be a coffee nook. Let's be like really honest. I'm never actually gonna drink coffee. <laughs> The Call idea it what of it, it is. When I showed them this, they asked me if I'd be down to have little C hooks mm -hmm. to hang mugs. And I was like, perfect. But I was already thinking, how are we gonna find a mug small enough for that? Ah. And they fit. Sorry, perfect. it's gonna be so cute. Like, to line them up, I'm <laughs> dead. This was the perfect find. We made out at yeah, the thrift store yesterday. We did. We did make out at the thrift store, but in the thrift store hauling type of way, roll the clip. Here for that. Okay, so we're at the first thrift store, and we do see that there's some decent decor here. What is that? It's a burger. I think so. <laughs> it's only five dollars. <gasps> I love elephants. Should we paint him? He's only three dollars. Yeah, we could totally paint him. Put him on the shelf. Like little black yeah. or yes. whatever other color we want. Yeah. 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 I love knickknacks. And I love elephants. I brought. Okay. Did you know they're good luck? Yeah. This is blue. Will this look good in there? Yeah. No. That means a no. no. That's a that's a Becky no. <laughs> This is so cute. We don't know what we're using it for, but we're gonna get it. Wait, oh my God, that's so cute. In gold and black. I feel like this would fit in one of her rooms. Yes. Gabby, do you need these? Gabby, Gabby. Gabby, she's gone, we lost her. Bye. Yeah, she's clothing shopping now. So on theme. Okay, and then the other thing, which like we didn't attempt to bring downstairs because it was hefty, mm -hmm. is the other thing we have is a white dresser. Um, I actually love the dresser. I just got it from IKEA mm -hmm. like three years ago, maybe, and I love it. It's solid wood. It fits perfectly. Awesome. So I really like the dresser, but there's so much white in that room already, and it's so open that I wanted to punch it up a little bit, make it a little more edgy, a little more gothic, yeah, a little more quirky. Okay, wait. We have one more thing that I know you briefly mentioned. Uh -huh. I'll just go grab it. Okay, and then we can discuss some plans for it. <laughs> wait, do I know what's happening? Yeah. So you mentioned this in passing. You're like, also, if you could do something with a coffee table, and I was like, oh, can we? Can we do something? What are your people? thoughts? Okay, so this is gonna be a little show off between Becky and I because we both came up with ideas and we're like, they're both pretty good. Okay, Gabby okay. with like both of them. Mm -hmm. My idea is I think both of them involve painting it black. And then I was thinking we could like drill holes into it to make a design. So like oh. imagine like a skull or something and you like drilled like a bunch of holes uh -huh. to be the design. You'll come up with a design, drill little holes. Like, can you 
Do you picture what I'm saying? I get it. My thought for this is going to be more like black and gold. So again, the black matte paint. Mm -hmm. And then like when I first saw this, I even asked, are there drawers in this slide? Because it looks like there could be. Uh -huh. So I think it could be really cool to do like ornate gold handles, like one on each side. Uh -huh. Like as if there was a drawer, but there isn't. And then on the bottom, like a couple inches, like paint the tips gold. So it looks like there's like metal tips on the bottom of the feet. Interesting. In gold. Yeah. That was my thought. Don't be sad. I would lean more towards that one because yes. the gold I like because I've been trying to pull in more gold because I've gold. Yeah, gold. and your whole house yeah. has a lot of gold too. That's nice to kind of pull in that like rustic yellow, yellowy, goldy. Okay, yeah, cool. Let's do that. We'll work on this and your room because we still have to finish that too. So you have just a, a couple nice things. Full day yeah. while I'm out oh, nice. going to therapy. Let's call it what it is. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll be back in probably a couple hours. Yeah. Okay. Amazing. Okay. Cool. These may or may not be done. Probably not. Sick. Okay. All right. See ya. Bye. Bye. <laughs> So we have our three pieces that we're gonna work on and I'm gonna start with the secretary writing desk now coffee nook. So as is the first step with pretty much any project that we're going to be painting, you wanna give it a light sand first. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll get on to fixing this whole situation. <laughs> I kind of feel like it's earthquake proof though because like it can ebb and flow, you know? Also these, we're, get, we're gonna do something about them, right? The knobbies. Oh honey, watch this. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. Sorry. Those two are on a bit more legit. Yeah, these ones are actually on. <laughs> so we gotta remove this glue and take off these knobs. And what we're actually planning to do is add a whole new knob, kind of like right here, instead of these two little pulls. So we're gonna need to fill them with some good old spackle. We don't really have wood filler here, but this will do. Yeah, for sure. Same dish, babes. So while my spackle dries, I'm going to work on tightening this. So there's literally just some screws that need to be tightened. And then I think we're missing one altogether on the bottom. So we're lucky it's even standing right now. Earthquake test part two. Better? Yeah, it's still like, but way better. Paint time. Paint time. Oh, hold on. That zoomed in terribly. Paint time! Paint time! Paint time. <laughs> the coolest paint color. No spoilers, but let's just say this is leftover from Gabby's. Base. A part of the house. <laughs> Ooh, Emerald Queen. I don't know if we've talked about this, or what we're doing on the inside. It's actually, it's nice walnut as is. But when Gabby spray painted this a little while ago, she got a little white everywhere. We had the idea of doing the inside as a wallpaper. We chose a couple of different wallpaper options. Gabby chose one. Maybe you guys can guess in the comments below. And we ordered it, and we're just hoping it gets here in time. We're gonna do this coffee table next, and like I said, it's gonna be like an ornate black and gold theme, which I think would be really cool. The first thing is there's a couple like divots in the top of it that, since we're painting it anyways, I'm just gonna putty it so it's all smooth, and then we can go ahead and start painting. And then like, I guess this, like some would say it's character, I would say, let's not. Well, because like this whole thing's gonna feel like fancy in the end, you know? It's not like farmhouse. Yeah, 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 copy. Right now it's farmhouse. Yeah, we don't want that for her. From farmhouse to fancy. <laughs> okay, what's next? Just standing off the dried pate. Because I want to do gold tips on the feet, it's so much easier to spray paint those gold now while I don't care about spray paint getting anywhere else on the table and then taping off just the gold to do the black later than it is to do all of the black and then cover it all to do a little bit of gold. And also while I'm at it, I picked up these handles to work as faux handles on the side and on the website they looked like gold, but IRL they're pretty brown. So I think I'm gonna paint those too while I'm at it. Ooh, why is it doing that? Is it resisting? Maybe I should sand it down more. Maybe it's got that like wax stuff on it. Oh no. It looks like it, you know, that wax stuff that we're actually gonna use later. Yeah. For that black paint. <laughs> ha! Ah ha! You must be able to sand that off. Take two. Oh my god. Let me try another leg. Mmm. Maybe she's not getting gold legs. That's crazy. I know. Like if I can do little layers and then like it sticks to itself almost, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know what will work, Becky? Painting the handles, for sure. A hundred percent, 10 out of 10. I'm going out of my way to use styrofoam, which is the big move for me. So it's gotta work. You guys don't know Becky hates styrofoam. Also, Look at that. what a hack, right? Hack, hack life. Oh yeah. 
like the color it was supposed to be. Is that so hard, hardware store? Okay, so it's the next day for me, and guys, look how good this looks. I think we all need more of this color in our life. And my next step is to add some hardware. So I have a little small knob here, which I didn't even have a knob here before, but I feel like it definitely needs one. Yeah, how do you open it? I don't, you open it like this, which is like, that's not what fancy people do. <laughs> so we're gonna put one here, and then a handle here, and then hopefully that wallpaper that we ordered in time will, will come today. That's like a TBD situation. So my knobs are on and I think they look fire. And the next step is to add the little C hooks for our cups. And I'm just gonna add them to the top on the inside here. And then all we need is that wallpaper. Got our thrifted mugs all in a row. <laughs> Instead of get your ducks in a row, get your thrifted mugs in a row. <laughs> Guys, the wallpaper came. I literally did not think it was gonna happen, but I have it. Did you guys make your guesses of which one Gabby chose? Which one do you think she chose? She chose this one. And I love it. It's so complimentary to this color. And then there's like green and it comes out. Oh, it's such a mood, I'm so excited. So now we're just gonna use an X-Acto knife and do some wallpaper all on the insides here. Day two, and we're back at it. I think there's like three coats of spray paint on this now, and the gold is definitely sticking much better. So enough that I'm gonna move on, and the rest of the plan for this is literally just paint it black. We have this black chalk paint, which is gonna be so easy for covering things. I think it doesn't need very many coats at all because it's heavy, and it's matte, and it's gonna look sexy. Looking good. What's going on with these legs? Okay, so I had a thought. In the room makeover we did on Gabby's channel, there was a special piece of art that Gabby helped us make that involved some really cool dripping of gold paint. So I thought, how cool would it be, instead of just doing straight lines around the legs, if it was gold dripping up the legs? So I might even ask Gabby, if she's not busy, to help us do it because she was so good at it the first time. Gabby! Gabby, can we borrow you for a sec? Okay, there she is. Oh, did Morning. you did you hear that you're needed for some yes, art expertise? I'm very <laughs> the one thing that I can do is literally just drip paint. It's literally your new favorite hobby, I think. It's a really good time, actually. It feels great. I think it's gonna look really good upside down like that. So sick. Just grace us with your drips. This is what happens when you don't have gold leaf. You just use your spray paint as paint. It actually works great. Yeah. And it's real drippy. It's real drippy. Oh, yes. Oh, baby. clean. It's super hard to control it because it's so wet. Yeah. I like how much between our projects in the other room and this one, how much we're kind of playing with like gravity. Plus, it's like the little things like that that kind of tie like your house together. Yeah. When you, there's like the drips in the one room, then you kind of notice them again in other parts of the yeah. house. That makes it special. Yeah. My very undying and problematic need to be different from everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> What does that say about my life? See, when I was a kid, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> if I could get this to drip all the way to the bottom on this one, that would be very, very cool. Come on, baby. You're like feeding it. I know. This drip's wildin' over here. You got that good drip. Drip, drip. Top needs another coat, as you can see. But I think what we've learned from this paint is like you can't, as it's drying, roller it. Oh, so it gets textured dirty. Oh my god, butterfly. <gasps> Land on me. <laughs> I'm gonna let this first coat dry like totally and then come in with the second coat so it doesn't get all like bumpy. Do you wanna put on the handles though? You can probably do that right now. Yeah, that's true. Wow, those handles are looking fire and also the drips kind of look like fire. <laughs> They're very cool. Okay, this is like 95% done. The very last step I need to do is just do this sealing wax that came with the chalk paint and just rub it all over everything so this doesn't scratch and chip and it's super durable. May or may not have cut up Gabby's shirt for this. She donated a shirt for the process. Now that our other projects are complete, we're going to get started on that dresser by painting it the same black as the table. Literally, how hot is it out here? It's so hot, like I can feel my skin frying. I wanna go back to Canada. My delicate Canadian skin can't handle. Um, wow, I was inside for five seconds setting up the main dresser and Good. You did it! Yeah, it needs another coat. But in like an alternate universe, this like patchy look is kind of cool. Like, a universe far, far away. Ooh, it looks like almost like the moon texture of the moon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! I feel you. There, you just had to like set it up for me a little. Pros to it being like a thousand degrees out is like I put it on and it's instantly dry. Holy shit! So it's gonna be fast. How hot is it out? 
It's a bit warm. I'd say. 31? That's it? No, I don't believe it. Liar. Meanwhile, inside, I'm gonna start this guy. I see a white dresser and I want <laughs> it painted black. It's looking good. I know. It's popping. The sigh of the relief. We're gonna wax this so it's sealed. This stuff makes all the difference for this to not scratch and like just look nice. Yeah, the matte, like chalky, like is not. Totally it makes it look rich without it being, it doesn't make it look shiny. It just makes it look like sealed. Signed, sealed, delivered. I'm yours. So the knobs were these black knobs, but then we bought these gold knobs. And yes, you can spray paint your knobs, but I am a little cautious about spray painting knobs just because you touch them so much, I don't want them to chip. And also this color is a lot nicer than like a metallic spray paint. And then lastly, Gabby actually had these dino knobs, which are really cool. And we didn't want them all to be dino knobs because we thought it might be like a little too much. So we're gonna like add them in sporadically. Oh my God, it's like dino, 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 pterodactyl. I love this. I have nothing else to say, but I love this. I think it looks so freaking chic and it just like pops a little bit more with the black and I cannot wait. Gabby's gonna freak. Okay, Gabby, ready? I'm coming in backwards. Hold my hand. Oh my god. Am I like the bride trying not to see her groom? Oh, you're gonna love this. Oh. Yeah. Okay, yeah. ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Fuck yeah! Dude, oh my god, the knots are great! Whoa, how did you make these guys? We added this like little bump here. Oh, smart! So like grab them. Oh wait, I need like a backup view of this. Do it! Wow, that looks so good. It looks way better without the dinosaur being over on every yeah, thing. Yeah, that's what we were thinking. Oh yeah, they're just like r random and patchwork. That's a makeover. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> I love that. It was a pretty dresser. I love the dresser. It's sturdy. It's great. But mm. now it's. Iconic. It's an art. It's yes, that is exactly what it is. This is perfect. Let's go look at the ass. The, the ass? What? The rest. <laughs> I'm very, very obsessed with this. It's so quaint. It's so different from the original. As I found it and as I tried to remake it myself, this is so precious. I love the perfect little hanging moment in here and the little cups. It's so sweet. It's such yeah. a sweet little piece. It looks amazing against the wall. Mm -hmm. which it's gonna look so good in your bed. Is this color green? We were trying. We were like trying not to expose, but whatever. <laughs> Basically, this is the color of the wall upstairs. Uh, so, so, it's gonna so be like it like blends in, but then you open this and it's like, oh my god. Yeah, the the yellow, the pop of the yellow is so nice. And this old timey, I had this exact print in my bedroom growing up. That's crazy. It's very cute, very sweet. I love, I love her so much. This is really this cool. Dude. This is another thing that was going to be absolute trash and it got brought with me on accident. And now it's a very great coffee table. Yeah, and your little drippies like totally made it again. Yeah, it's so spooky. It's, it's like <laughs> backwards, it's almost like flames. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. It's so cool. It's, it's like cool. It's like ratchet cheek. <laughs> I love this. You guys absolutely crushed it. Uh, All of it is phenomenal. Oh my god. Well, wow. thank you for no, letting us thank here. You. Thanks. You're so incredibly talented. Oh, thank, you. thank you. And make sure you guys check out our um, office makeover on your channel. You have to see it. It yeah. is so stunning. I've sent pictures to everybody <laughs> and everybody's like, that's incredible. Thank you. thank you. You did a lot of work for me, so thank you. We had it's a day, but it was worth it. It was fun. It was fun. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you give it a like. And if you love it, make sure you sub it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Oh, guys. cute outro. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, that I am helping. <laughs> okay. In her cute hat. <laughs> wow. That I found at the thrift store with them yesterday. Oh my god. And your cute shirt. Can you show them? Oh wow. <gasps> who that? Who that? I don't link, know. Link Is it merch that might just happen to be linked down below? <laughs> or what's up?